Hi guys, this is Rishabh Kapoor from WebSoftTutorials.com. In this video, guys, I will show you that how can you work with an image in WordPress. Means how can you insert an image in inside your post or pages. So, firstly, guys, you need to click on post or cl uh, click to click on add new. Or you can also use image in your existing post by using edit button of the post. So, I write image post and you can see this button add media you need to click on it you can also select the images from this media library or if the uh, if the images are already uploaded if you want to upload a new image you need to click on this upload files click on this select files and you can browse your image from here you need to click on it you can set the title of the image you can set the caption write the caption you can type the alternate text or you can write the description as well now you can see link to media file attachment page custom URL or none I'll select none because I don't want to uh, um, link it to any file so and the size if you want to use a thumbnail if you want to use medium size or if you want to use full size so I'll click on full size and click on insert into post now you can see the image is included click on visual now you will see the image just click on this publish button now click on view post now you can see this is the image which we have used inside the post now we need to click on this media and click on library this will show the all the list of all the medias used in this WordPress. This is the image which we have just included. Guys, here's a one more way which you, uh, with which you can y use images in your posts. If you have good knowledge of WordPress, oh sorry, <laughs> if you have good knowledge of CSS and HTML, then you can use this way. Click on Add it click on text you need to use image tags here image source equal to then the source of the image which you can use it from here click on add it you will see this file URL you need to copy it Oops. copy and paste image source then click on update and refresh now I can see this is the first image this is the second image means if you have knowledge of HTML and CSS then you can also use images like this now we will go to the library again you can edit delete or view the images from here and you can also to the check the date when it was uploaded so guys in this way you can work with media and WordPress and guys if you uh, I want to tell you one more thing uh, in media we can also include audio files or video files which we will cover in our upcoming video when we use plugins so guys if you have any question you can go to my discussion forum or you can leave a comment below so thanks for watching this video guys don't forget to subscribe my channel to get recent updates about my videos so let's see in the next tutorial